A new report finds climate change skeptics could reach catastrophic levels by 2020. The nation's gratuitously sexual couples announce plans to wait in line at Six Flags. And a local grandpa looks absolutely precious in his new baseball cap. Offering a one-stop shop for all your peerless online news summary needs, this is The Onion Week in Review. In response to the escalating violence and rising death toll in Gaza this week, Israel unveiled a new defense system to deflect accusations of human rights violations. Israeli officials praised the new safety structure's ability to intercept an international barrage of war crime allegations and divert criticisms of Palestinian civilian casualties before they can ever hope to make contact with the Jewish state. This week, a new study released by Duke University concluded that only 5% of Americans have the correct amount of pride in their country. Researchers found that most Americans outside this population fell into one of two extremes. Those individuals compelled by an inordinate amount of love for their country to adhere bumper stickers to their cars or get a Stars and Stripes tattoo, and those whose respect for the country is so low they fail to even attend a cookout or otherwise celebrate on the 4th of July. Our findings suggest that only a tiny fraction of Americans hold the belief that they are part of a moderately prosperous nation that affords them many opportunities while simultaneously wronging peoples both home and abroad. Notably, we found that all Americans who possess the correct amount of patriotic pride also own a pair of star-spangled pants. A new study released this week revealed that the average heart attack victim doesn't clutch at his or her chest nearly dramatically enough after detecting chest pain. Doctors from Johns Hopkins University spoke to reporters about the risks of not reacting melodramatically enough. If you're having a heart attack, don't just sit down and breathe calmly while a bystander dials 911. Is there anyone within reaching distance whose shirt or lapel you could desperately grip while slowly sinking to your knees? Is there a fully set table that you can careen into? Every second counts. And in this week's sports news, a rape investigation finds a star college quarterback has got the goods. In other news, a new state law requires doctors to scale an 18-foot wall surrounding abortion clinics. A study finds high school students retain only one-third of their obsolete curriculum over the summer, and a man's anxiety is not about to let depression muscle in on its turf. The likelihood that intelligent extraterrestrial life exists is overwhelming, and so I beseech my alien brethren, please, wise ones, bring me to your planet, for my capacity capacity for wonder has been exhausted on this barren land. For more, keep checking theonion.com.